Hey guys, this week we're sitting down with senior Emily Ranso. So Emily, what was your favorite part of the fall season so far? Um, favorite part of the fall season was definitely Tennessee. Um, I love that tournament because I felt like, you know, we, we proved everyone wrong because no one thought that we could win it, and but we as a team felt like we were good enough and we beat some great teams and it was an amazing golf course and it was just a fun atmosphere to play in and, and everyone was really supportive of each other, which I loved and it's great on the golf course because that doesn't really happen that much because everyone's so spread out, so it was, it was nice. After the first two tournaments of the spring season are uh, done so far, how do you feel the girls have done? Um, you know, our first tournament was a struggle. We didn't have the best um, weather, but you know, it it was it was not our best. But um, last tournament we finished third, and you know, we're we're climbing towards you know um, doing doing better in practice and really working hard to to get to a a good finish to the spring season. Hopefully, make it to regionals and nationals. So. What made you decide to come and play golf for Penn State? Um, I, uh, I actually was pretty, pretty anti Penn State before I came up and visited just because, you know, I'm from Columbus, Ohio, right by Ohio State, and my mom made me come up here, and after my visit here, I canceled every, um, visit that I had, um, after because I fell in love with the campus. I mean, it's, it's absolutely beautiful. The academics here are amazing, and, um, I just really had a connection with our coach, Denise. She's like a second mother to me. I've been really grateful to play under her. And, and the community here is phenomenal. They're so supportive of our athletic program. And it's just a really great atmosphere to be a part of and, and play for Penn State. I just, I just absolutely love it. So. What made you decide to come and play golf for Penn State? Um, I, uh, I actually was pretty, pretty anti Penn State before I came up and visited just because you know, I'm from Columbus, Ohio, right by Ohio State, and my mom made me come up here, and after my visit here, I canceled every um, visit that I had um, after because I fell in love with the campus. I mean, it's, it's absolutely beautiful. The academics here are amazing, and um, I just really had a connection with our coach, Denise. She's like a second mother to me. I've been really grateful to play under her, and, and the community here is phenomenal. They're so supportive of our athletic program and it's just a really great atmosphere to be a part of and, and play for Penn State. I just, I just absolutely love it. So. What was your favorite tournament you ever played in at Penn State? Um, well, it happens every year. It's the Ohio State tournament. Um, so like I said, I'm from Columbus, so it's nice to, to go back and uh, play at home and have friends and family come out. It's just, it feels really good to, to be able to do that and it's a lot of fun. Who's the funniest girl on the team? Grace Chung, our freshman, she is absolutely hilarious. Um, I don't think I've ever seen her mad, which is, you know, I don't, I don't know. I, she's just so much fun to be around, and she always puts a smile on my face, which can be pretty hard at times. So. What was your favorite class you ever taken at Penn State? Um, I'm in the professional golf management program here, so um, you know, golf is pretty much my whole life. So the, the favorite of all my classes I've taken is um, my teaching class, intermediate teaching. Um, you know, just learning how to teach golfers and <clears throat> explain, you know, the golf swing to them and, and be knowledgeable about the golf swing. I absolutely love and it's a passion of mine, so it was really fun to take that class. If you could play one golf course in the world, where would you play? Um, honestly, I don't, we went to Ireland for spring break and I don't think any golf course could beat what the golf courses we played on out there. It was the most phenomenal place I've ever been and, and um, some of the courses are out there have the most ridiculous views and it's just, I don't think anything could beat that. So. <laughs> Who's your favorite athlete? Um, well, I have a lot of favorite athletes, but one of them would be Katie Future. She's actually on the LPJ right now. She played for Penn State and the reason I like her and follow her is because she, she hasn't forgotten about her roots. She's very supportive of the Penn State team here. And she's always open to you know questions, and she always emails us back right away if we have you know any questions for her, or, you know just to see how she's doing. She keeps in great contact with us, which I love, and I think it's really important. So, it's, you know, a good relationship there. What's your favorite thing to do when you're not playing golf? Um, I love to watch movies. I actually, most of the things I, that come out of my mouth or that I say are quotes from movies. So. Um, you know, watching movies and hanging out with friends, there's nothing really better than that. So. Last question for you, Emily. 
How's it being a senior leader on this team and guiding some of the youngsters like Elise and Grace? Um, it's kind of, it's kind of weird to think that I'm a senior. I still feel like a freshman, but no, it's they teach me more than I think I could teach them. They're they're great to be around, and um, you know, it's nice if they have a question for me. I just you know I try to answer it as best as possible for my experiences. But honestly, they're you know all all my teammates. We teach each other so and then help each other out so it's it's really a um a great atmosphere and so, you yeah, know being a senior is just it's kind of sad but great. thank you for your time emily and wish you and the girls rest uh best of luck in the rest of the spring season thank you